One of the most interesting aspects of this was actually trying to get the script down to three minutes. That was quite challenging. Six minutes, 15 seconds. Once I'd done that, actually setting up a storyboard was quite straightforward for me because I'm quite a visual type person. So using a whiteboard, just to sort of sketch things out. Um, that then was sort of quite easily translated onto um, a template. And that was good because I could take that around with me when I went filming. I think the important shots to get out of the way first were the time lapse because I think they were quite weather dependent and with a, with a you know, 10 week window, I just wanted to get stuck into those. Um, and actually that worked out well because first I went out to Dewsbury Cemetery, it was perfect. I think the second thing I enjoyed was working with another filmmaker. Um, I couldn't get to film the Cornish engines at Kew working because they finished working for this year, so I got in touch with another filmmaker and did this collaborative film with him. And again, I actually sort of quite enjoyed the contact and the dialogue between us. My, my script, my voiceover, Poor it did prove quite challenging. Poor and tapped. <laughs> this was cut in the past is engraved. Many people feel that this monument to the past, the past is in grave danger. Set up for the slow motion water. Titles themselves, I did a Photoshop using loads of different layers. And setting the custom white balance, which I quite enjoyed doing. All this pre-preparation really enabled me to just go out and just enjoy the filming without thinking about it. And I think that really was a benefit.